Your Way to Yoga. What to Expect from this book by Ayama Flow. The purpose of yoga, perhaps, is the complete internalization of self. This book, Your Way to Yoga, is still worth your time, especially with the low cost. The book's aim of being a modern guide to yoga, explaining all the different and new types of practice, and talks about how to be a yogi without being vegetarian, but also how to mix naturian, but also how to mix naturopathy with your yoga practice. Chapter 1. What is Yoga? Yoga is a millennial discipline born in India that aims to calm the mind, balancing body and mind, and uniting oneself with the universe. It is above all a personal, psycho-physical, and energetic path of alignment and expansion through movement, anas, breathing, pranayama, and calm of the mind, tayana. Representations of some positions on coins, tablets, and seals have been found. Therefore, the earliest evidence dates back to 5000 DC in India. At that time, all the teachings were handed down orally from master to disciple, until the first signs of this word on written works were found in the Vedas. Exactly in the Upanishad, philosophical and mystical poems written in Sanskrit that explore the nature of the human soul and belong to the period ranging from 1500 BC to 500 BC. Yoga was intended as a set of meditative techniques with the purpose of controlling the senses and to reach ultimate reality. Samadhi, the highest state of mental concentration that people can reach while they are still tied to the body and joining them to the higher reality. Chapter 2. The Eight Limbs of Patanjali Yamas, Niyamas, Asana, Pranayama, Pratyahara, Dharana, Dhyana, Samadhi. These are described in detail in the book. The author also writes, I want to end this part with a quote from Gurudev Sri Sri Ravi Shankar. Yoga has eight limbs, like a chair with four legs. Everyone is connected to the whole. If you pull a leg, comes the whole chair. When the body develops, the whole body develops together. All body, organs develop together. Not first the nose and then the ears come. All aspects, all parts of the body develop simultaneously. That's why Patanjali says that these are all the arts of yoga and develop simultaneously. Chapter 3 Pranayama is the practice of breath regulation. In Sanskrit, prana means energy vital and ayama means control. It is a fundamental component of yoga and consists of breathing. Exercises for the physical and mental well-being. Chapter 4. Mantra. Chapter 5. Mudra. And why do we say namaste? Chapter 6. What are the nadis? Chapter 7. Doshas and gunas. Chapter 8. Chakras, they are a complex and ancient energy system that originated in India. Chapter 9. The Obstacles of Practice Why can't I be consistent with my practice? How do I overcome these obstacles? Chapter 10. The Styles of Yoga With time, various styles of yoga were born and some move away from real practice. Why? Chapter 11. Yoga and Vegetarianism Do you have to be vegetarian to practice yoga? Chapter 12. Trauma and Stress How to Avoid and Overcome Them Chapter 13 Essential Oils in Yoga How to Use Them During Your Practice The book is available on Amazon in both Italian and English. Your Way to Yoga will guide you through all the steps of this ancient practice and help you to adapt it to your body and to your lifestyle. Remember, as we go beyond the physical and improv our inner environment, our thoughts, beliefs, and emotions. We can shift our lives and help in powerful ways. Get it now at low cost and enjoy your reading. You can also check out the Instagram page of the author, Ayamaflow.